Where were you? Uh, oh, we're oh, back. <laughs> this is take number three. I think it's four. Oops. <laughs> Hi, I'm Damien. I'm Paula. And I'm Clayton. And I'm Brandon. I'm Romy. I'm Priscilla. And we are Sun Gold Photography. Who's most likely to cry at a wedding? Yeah. <laughs> I have seen my wife cry. She shed tears at a wedding. And she hides behind her camera and she thinks nobody's seen her. <laughs> but that's just how fun she is. Who's the photographer that has to have coffee at the wedding? Hmm. <laughs> yeah. I'm from Colombia, so we're practically I don't coffee know. fiends. Yeah. <laughs> sure you are. <laughs> um, suggest the the wedding couple's location. Do the brides come or? Damien. I do because of the fact that I feel like sometimes the clients don't really know. And as a photographer, you have to be able to advise your clients properly on location, lighting, you know, how busy the environment might be or not. And you try to learn more about the client to kind of get a feel of who they are. Are they city people? Are they country folks? Do they want to be in a field or do they want to be in city lights? So I usually try to know great locations to where I can make suggestions as far as that's concerned. Which photographer is going to choose the harshest light? Huh. These two. Uh, uh, these two. I wouldn't say harsh light. Because they can adapt <coughs> and they can exactly. correct it. Um, I, I chase the light. We chase the light. And that's what I think photography is about. A lot of people run for the shade. We try to embrace whatever light we have to work in and make it as beautiful as possible. But you know what? Be coming from our background, working from Jamaica, yeah. where we have that big wide ocean as our backdrop most of the time, that's a hard we try to, to work yes. again. We so to. it makes we, we adapt, ahead. Yeah. <laughs> we adapt to these arch lighting when to you get come those to the sunsets. Right? And by the way, yeah. if nobody else knows this, do you know that Texas and Jamaica has the same weather? <laughs> right now, isn't it? Yeah. Who's the most fashionable one on at a wedding? I'm the most practically it. fashionable one at a wedding. I got it. Everybody got a point on okay? Craig. Craig can't walk out of the house until he is dressed to the booth. Check out yeah, the I gotta scarf. make sure that everything is perfect before I step up. He's wearing a scarf in July. Let it do July. Don't hear me. Sorry, it's too late. The window open here. Who's most likely to wear the most comfy shoes? Oh, me. Yeah. I'm gonna get the ladies. Not today. Not today. But yes. Because uh, every wedding I go to with Priscilla, she's always wearing comfy shoes. Yes. I'm of jealous of her comfy shoes. I wear trainers. I gotta like look. Train. I gotta look as crappy as I can be to look good, and wear the most uncomfortable shoes I can find <laughs> <laughs> to look good. And she's just wearing these trainers. beautiful loafers that looks like you could sleep in them. <laughs> Damon, I think I think they're called trainers. <laughs> they're called big slippers. Big slippers. I feel like that's oh, really the most ninja-like at a wedding. It gotta be neat. Yeah. It gotta uh, be neat. Maybe David said that. I can fly. Alright. Who's the most likely to be the most beautiful? I have no comment. No comment. <laughs> All joking aside, we are a family. We do love weddings. It is our passion. We are Sun Gold Photography. And we do want to be there on your special day. And that's right! Ah!